Well, Senate Bill 354 has a lot of law enforcement officials up in arms tonight. It's a proposed bill that would allow teenagers to carry concealed weapons in their car. One of the bill's sponsors says it's being misinterpreted and is actually a law that most southern states already have in place. We believe this bill would be very dangerous for law enforcement. Mobile County Sheriff Sam Cochran is fighting to make sure Senate Bill 354 does not pass. The bill would authorize a person to carry a pistol in his or her vehicle and on certain property without a concealed pistol permit. It does not have an age restriction in the bill. Well, teens, of course, are the most dangerous mix with the guns, but it would allow other people, it would allow people that I might would turn down a permit, could leave out and still carry a gun in their car where I may have denied them for various reasons of public safety reasons or even mental health reasons. One of the sponsors of the bill, Senator Rusty Glover of SEM, says a person is not supposed to have a gun under the age of 18 anyway. So it's not that any teen can carry a gun and not have to answer to law enforcement. When he says teens, a lot of people are, are saying 16-year-olds, 17-year-olds, and some 18-year-olds. But this would be, uh, you, you cannot have it you know, when you're younger than 18. Senator Glover says this is a law that has passed in every other southern state except Alabama and Tennessee with no problem. Virginia, North Carolina, South Carolina, uh, Georgia, Florida, Louisiana, and Texas have this bill already. And uh, so Alabama, we're just trying to get in line. We've had a lot of constituents say, you know, if these states can have it, why can't we have, you know, ability to have the gun in the car? Still, it's not sitting easy with local sheriffs. This is not a Second Amendment right. This has nothing to do with the amendment of the right to keep and bear arms. This is a law enforcement and citizen protection issue, public safety issue. Well, Senator Glover says even though he backs the bill, he doesn't think it will pass because it's so late in the session to come to the table. Now, I also spoke with Senator Vivian Figures. She says she will vote against this bill. Now, to read the entire bill, go to the Find It page of our website, local15tv.com.